Well, members of Brooklyn's Muslim and Jewish community coming together Sunday to make friends and play some ball at Floyd Bennett Field. News 12 Brooklyn reporter Hannah Klieger explains how one NBA star helped make this all happen. Hundreds of kids packed into the gym at Aviator Sports and Events Center. Some of them wore a kippah, while others donned a baseball cap. Some wore skirts and others basketball shorts. But all of them were excited. They love basketball, I can tell. They're obsessed with basketball, but uh, it's just so much fun to just be going out there just talking one language and it's sport. NBA star Ennis Cantor hosting a free basketball clinic on Sunday as these kids came out to shoot some hoops. Well, Ennis is basically doing the same drills that he does for an NBA team. He's treating this as a NBA basketball camp. But the clinic, organized by Kingsway Jewish Center and Turkish Cultural Center of Brooklyn, and run by Cantor, a practicing Muslim, wasn't just about basketball. Breaking down the barriers between people helps to break down stereotypes and uh, create uh, good citizenship in our country. Organizers say this is a way to unite the Turkish Muslim community and the Orthodox Jewish community. And they say one great way to unite kids and build friendships is through a good old game of basketball. I think the most important thing in life, you know, to just leave your differences on the table and try to find what we have in common. And the most important thing, you know, we are human first. And we are neighbor. People don't know each other. And those kind of events engage people. And not just one-time engagement, you know, we would like to build our, you know, relationship. Walking in with their love for the game and walking out with new friends and a newfound respect for one another. I feel very proud that uh, as a main hub of the largest Orthodox synagogue in Brooklyn, we're able to bring two faiths together for such a great event. At Floyd Bennett Field, Hannah Flieger, News 12, Brooklyn. All right, Hannah, thank you for that report. We're well, moving on now. Uh, more news to get to the Women of the Courage Mission is offering.